Welcome to another pleasurable moment on TV. Wherever you are, whatever you're doing, you need to stay put because we got you. My name is Annie Wine and you're welcome to Muse on TV. What is wrong with you? I'm looking dapper, so I have to double dap. Dapper, da okay, fine. Just, can you just introduce yourself? Okay, my name is Larry Foreman, so... Huh. Please, Larry, can I ask you for something today? This is the first time I'm going to beg you for anything. Okay, actually. Can you please be sane? I beg you. Double dap, double dap, double dap. <sighs> Okay, guys, my name is Larry Fong. You're welcome to Music TV. And I'm really happy because anyone is around. Thank you. Yes, and um, you just have to know that um, anyone is a really great <laughs> lady. She's a great lady. Okay, it's trying to bribe me or toast me. I don't know what you're trying to do, but whatever. I'm just going to ignore you. Okay. So, talent plus creativity, if not developed, is nothing. And talking about same, we have a bunch of that to showcase for you today, starting with the Sparkle Musical event. And also, like she said, uh, talent is important. So Very we're talking important. about the most talented producers. Uh, producer particular, he yeah. used to be a DJ. Yeah. Then, then he now became a producer. And right now, down to all award-winning artists, he has been part of their growth. Ladies and gentlemen, we'll be talking about someone special. We just don't want to give you up. And why are you not talking about the fact that he's very good looking? Because that's the part you talk about. Okay. Not me. Whatever. Why can't you talk about it? Because it's like this. Like, you know. Okay. <laughs> Afterwards, we have the top five music videos by David Do. O B O. Uh, now, the music videos we're talking about is the fact that his symbol as an artist and the one he gets featured on. So, yeah. we're looking at the fusion of both. Top so, five. all yeah. that is what you do not want to meet on the show today. So, don't move a muscle. We <coughs> are going to be right back. We'll be right back, guys. News on TV. Alright, guys. Welcome to Muse on TV. Don't Anybody that did that voiceover really did a great job. <laughs> Who's on TV? <laughs> okay, now this is the part where we get to do uh, the one on one, the tete a tete, the interview segment, and I guess you know about it, right? Yes, they do know, I'm sure. Okay, now we're going to be interviewing, we're going to be talking to someone that is a great producer. When you're a great producer, also a great DJ, that's like adding to very good adjectives. So yeah. I think I'll leave you to do those adjectives for the baby. <laughs> Super duper, amazing, good. That's wrong, but whatever, just say what you were saying. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we have the privilege to have amazing DJ Kublan, someone that's actually been effective in the career building of Life of Kiss Daniel. Yeah. That full album of Iyanya. Iyanya. Triple MG. Triple MG, he has been everywhere. And guess what, when you have the very good understanding of being a DJ, and producer, you know the beats, timing, four by four. Mm -hmm. You have the warrior, pow, 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 he does it well, and he works with a lot of instrumentalists, a good instrumentalist. We're talking about DJ Kublin too. He's a good one too. Yeah, right? and this, I don't know why I keep missing the fact that it's good looking. Like, it's good looking. <laughs> I had the interview with him, so I know a lot about him. Like, I saw him face to face. <laughs> I had an interesting time with him, by the way. I learned a lot of things, and I'm sure you are going to learn a couple of things too, by the way. So, what is going on? It's so annoying that this lady has been presenting with me for a long time and she's never said I'm good looking. Oh, oh, and I, well, and I never said you're not good looking, so. Okay, now, during the course of the show, we still have the Sparkle of <laughs> Event and our top five David O shows. So check out a good looking DJ Kublan's Blind. interview. <laughs> check it out. Stop waiting. Hey there guys, so music can be interpreted in various ways, 
spiritual healing whatever whatever but what makes it that way because of how the lyrics the beats everything is all put together and who are those who does the things well, the music producers. So, which tells you that I do have a music producer in the studio today. And it's good looking, by the way. Ladies, mm. be warned. It's, it's good looking. <laughs> I have DJ Kublon in the house. How are you doing? I'm good. I'm good, good to have you here. Thank you. DJ Kublon, yeah. you used to be a DJ. Mm. That was when I was in you know, secondary school. Okay, yeah. so it was because usually I hear like most producers, not most producers, but mm -hmm. some producers, yeah. when their names start with DJ. Mm -hmm. So I'm curious, what is the transition from being a DJ to a music producer? Well, for a DJ, you know, a DJ works with what the music producer has put together. Yeah. While the music producer does everything from the scratch. Okay, so, so which takes me the question, to the question of what is music to you? Well, music is putting together nonsense and bringing out sense. Yeah. <laughs> okay, in my own personal opinion, I believe that before um, I started hearing about DJ Kublon here, mm. DJ Kublon there, yeah. DJ Kublon everywhere, yeah. it was after Kiss Daniel's Moju. Yes. That yeah. is, in my own honest opinion. I understand. So I would like you to clarify that. Well, um... The thing is, I started out with Likwaoku by Inyaya. That was, that was my first major production. Oh, yeah, yeah I know so, that song. Um, I think that was a song, you know, that made Kistanel's boss, Stars Emperor Jeezy, yeah. work with me. And then, yeah, we came out with Wuju and much of that songs after Wuju. Yeah, so um, aside from Kistanel, yeah. who are the people you have worked with, the heavy artists you've worked with in the industry? Well, um, I've worked with some. I've worked with Davido, worked with Emanara, worked with um, Iaya, Techno, Yeah. Of what, of what are the basic tools that you think a music producer requires? Like basic tools, basic mental tools? Well, um, what I would say is everyone is creative. You know, every musician, you know, aspires to be to bring to bring out that light in whatever ideas they have yeah. know, but most people focus too much on the music itself forgetting that the creativity depends on how you interact with other aspects of life because that would throw more light you know as to the music itself because if we focus too much on the music and disregard every little thing around you know in the general aspects of life we will we lose the, the feel we lose that the, the 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 chemistry. How would you describe your own experience when it comes to success and failure? Well, um, what I would say is these setbacks that I've experienced so far, we keep experiencing them because that's what keeps us going forward. You know, if everything is easy, uh, I think it, that that means it's scam. You know, <laughs> so um, it has to be difficult so that when when you when you win eventually, you know um, you would appreciate that success. Yes. You know if it comes easily, that's the same way to go. So so far, I I came into the industry 2012. You know that was when I started out professionally, and 2013 I got to work with you know most A-list artists by then because yeah, yeah. yes. So yeah. from there we were growing. Not like it was it was easy all the way, but. Um, Experiences I've I, I had with different people who also taught me taught me how to you know interact with the music. Okay. So, so we're gonna do something fun. Okay. So excuse me for a minute. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> I was asking you if the city is becoming hot. You said no. You will feel the hotness now. Well, let's, let's so I do have um, a cup, you know, cutlery. Mm -hmm. You are going to create like a beat for me I with this. <laughs> because, you're <a> music <laughs> because you are a music producer, that okay. is why you are going to do that. So. Okay. <laughs> okay, so guys, um, about, I had fun. Yes, I did, especially the part where we had to create a beat, and I did a good job. Assistant DJ Kublon, by the way. She did very well. Yeah. Oh, she nice. Well. Thank you. I like the fact that I'm hearing that from you. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I learned so much too, by the way. I'm sure you did. So right now, we need to go. We need to take it back to the studio. Yeah. 
Views on TV. All right, guys, of course, as you know, as a producer, I just need to be very cool and calm, you know. I like producers because they're very cool and calm. Don't yes, you think? I like the Jacoblon precisely. Yes, I'm not saying liking him is like a problem. So but however, did you learn anything from the interview? I know you were going to ask me that. But yes, I always listen, do. You know, Jacoblon is very calm and he's solo. <laughs> so I just learned to be a producer and Ow. a DJ and an instrumentalist so I could make a lot of good songs. You know? And did you see the part where I challenged him to... You know, create a beat. Yeah, I can create beats too. You do, you can? I try. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> Moving on, guys. It is time to have fun with a Sparkle musical event. Now, this is a show that actually launched a record label. I was talking about talent and creativity the other time. Now, this is where we see a bunch of that. The record label signed two artists, Ontoji and Sean Banky. Nice. And I think... Those guys are really talented. Well, I feel in Nigerian industry, we're saying, please try and read your contract before you sign yeah, any important. record label. Because a lot of people, you just feel that the houses, the, the cars, cars, the, the cash, cash no. you need good. to read you those You just read papers. your contract so that you don't fall in any mayhem. Um, but it's good that a lot of people are trying to invest in talented people, yeah. mm -hmm. which is very good. We have a lot of talented Nigerians. And guess what? The Nigerian music industry is a huge export in the international field. Yes, yeah, so and I think the most important thing is, you know, um, leveraging in whatever platform you have. Exactly. So yeah. whatever record label that signs you, I think you just need to make good use of it. Very. Don't forget to read those papers. So you should ask me my talent. Oh, you, you do have one. Yes. What is it? I'm a boxer. In fact, I invented boxing day. Fine. <laughs> okay, I won't say anything to now. I'm just, I'm just gonna ignore you. Okay, guys. Right now, let's go have fun with the Sparkle <laughs> Musical Event. Enjoy. Enjoy. Hey there guys, <laughs> today we have the celebration of talent and innovation, it's a sparkle musical event, we are launching a new record label today, it's called MMOV Nigeria, well I said it is a celebration of innovation and talent because two artists are signed to this record label, well I'm here on the red carpet, you trust me, I'm going to be bringing everything you need to know and of course we're going to be going in to see what is going to happen. I'm your news agent, Eddie Wine, holding it down for you right here at the Up Lounge, Ikeja, Lagos, Nigeria. Stick around, guys. <laughs> Let's meet you. I'm Victoria Wambreze. If you do recognize MMOV, if you recognize, if you can record with a sparkle musical event that you recognize with this guy, Anta G himself is one of the guys signed to MMOV record. All How right. you doing? I'm all right. I'm doing good. And you're looking good yourself. Thank you very much. Okay. My name is Damlola Ladi George and my stage name is Diela. Let's meet you. All right. My name is Femi, Femi Trinity. Femi Trinity. Oh, What's well. your name? Yeah, my name is Blake Moon. Blake Moon. To have fun, and I want you to perform for me right now. I woke up one Sunday morning, told my daddy I'm leaving home, going off to the city tomorrow, even though I don't know where to go. <laughs> daddy says, son, don't be a fool. Life in the city is unbelievable. Yeah. Isn't that enough? <laughs> okay, it's enough, it's enough. So you are going to make me blush. That is the task. If I fall in love today, I go marry you today. And I swear to you, girl, I will never lie. Are you blushing? Okay. I guess. <laughs> Looking this gorgeously dressed, what were you expecting to come get here? 
Well, nothing but fun. Like, I'm, I, I'm here to have fun. Um, there are people performing that you know, so what do you expect to get from them? Um, it's, I think, the best. So, how do you want to wow me and other people that are looking forward to you performing? Okay, that's why they call me Mr. Wonder. I don't know why it happens, but I know when I get on the stage, something just happens. Welcome back, guys. I hope you enjoyed that, the Sparkle musical event. Yeah, of course. It was yeah, great. Yeah, so right now we need to move on to the top five musical videos by David Davido. O. Now, this David O for me as an artist has, he, because a lot of people said he's from a rich home, the Adele kids. And for me, what makes him special is the fact that he was brought up and trained by someone that is very, very renowned, yeah. wealthy. But it doesn't stop him from working hard. Yeah, he he's, works really he's hard. He's a real hard worker. And for me, David Doe is a face to recognize and a force to, to reckon with. with. Yes, exactly. I really do in respect the, the fact that he works very hard. And very when hard. His, his music, I think what strikes me about his music, he's during his performance, he's always energetic. energetic. Oh, Lord of mercy. And, and, and he never uh, misses uh, it. Then another thing is the fact that you people just feel that he doesn't have a good voice. Listen, y'all. <laughs> he knows what he sings and he sings. You know, the way we judge people with voices, you just have to have that very Craig David voice. <sighs> nah, nah, we don't want, but he knows how to use his voice but well. I'm not saying, and his voice is making a lot of money for him. I'm not saying you should come with that very tiny voice. I'm just saying that. Why would you come with that? <sighs> You're trying to find your balance in the first 30 seconds. A little. What are you doing to your voice, bro? I, I, I like you. I'm not, uh, I'm, I think I'm a fan. Basically, for me, David O. I'm just is, saying. Mm, like the first Nigerian or African to be signed to Sony Music worldwide, not yeah. the Afri South African chapter. And in my worldwide. opinion, I think David likes to make noise about a lot of things. No, so he he's 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 good at his brags. He loves his brags, and we all love the fact that he brags. Do you know what nobody likes? What to show off? No, I like showing off. I respect David. All. I love you, bro. You show up. Look at my bling. Look at it. Look at it. I bling. I'm showing off. All right, okay, let's start with our top, uh, first two features. <laughs> okay, uh, first two features, what is the first one we have? Um, we have the one he did with... Mafiki Zolo. Now this... Chelete. Now let me show you what he did in that video. He was super restless, I don't know what happened. Maybe he didn't sleep the overnight. The one that he was jumping was on the... <laughs> I even do it because I'm just going to scatter this place. It was just jumping up and I'm like, dude, fine. I know you want to give us that energy. We really He's very appreciate energetic. it, but calm down. By the way, um, as of that time, I think um, the Mafis, Mafiki Solos, yeah. you know, you trust them with their costumes. Oh, Lord. Amazing people, they have it. And, and their dance steps, they always was, come up with something. That, that same song was nominated for the Mama Awards. Okay, so let's not say too much about this song. Um, guys, go watch... Mafiki Zolo featuring David O with Chalete. <laughs> yeah, he did that. No, I can't do that. No. I Just tried enjoy it. the video. You're back? You mean we're back? Okay, guys, we're back. Better. <sighs> now, for David O featuring Runtown. Now, Runtown and David O, they, they have had this connection like forever. Um, his very big song, I was being written by Runtown. Uh, in case you all don't know, it was written by Runtown. Um, oh, the uh, slogan, Emergency, was being 
coined by Runtown. So you should know that when Runtown decides to evolve and say, David will come on my song, he Let's has everything to yeah. come on the song. Now you see this song, amazing song, the whole black setting, Runtown with his black collado and yeah. David coming up with the whole everything. I, li- I like the video and it, it's a heat track because everybody love. I must say, I'm going to make it in And I like the part where the video was like, I can't even make, make them. <laughs> <laughs> like, dude, what's wrong with your voice? Yeah, but y'all check it out. <laughs> Lovely song. Enjoy Run- it. Run Town, David O. Galado. Okay, we're back and we're back with this one. This is the time where we're going to give you the video singles and this was where he was just the solo artist that sang the song, wrote the song. And coming up on this one is the song that everybody loved after his when back with broke you and I everything. need to do the spot okay wait <laughs> when back with broke you da, 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 da. and he featured A to see yeah. he dropped another song <coughs> way bigger and hotter <laughs> and the song actually got him signed to convict music guess what is <laughs> okay, check it out. I can't I can't really believe I did that. Well check it out still. Check it out by the way. Welcome back from that one. Emma Damiduro, okay, let's not that. Hello, Emma Damiduro, please, I don't have time. Moving on to number two is, um, ah, yeah. I love that video, I love the setting of the video. love anyone, why would you love? I'm sorry, girl. I'm sorry. I, okay, I'm sorry. Really? I'm sorry. I never said that. I love the video. I love the setting. I think Clarence did an amazing job with the amazing video. Song. So, yeah. this is David Doe with Aie. Enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> back um now we're about to do his amazing songs right now is actually going everywhere everybody likes his song the fact that it brings us from um the world of the past and coming bring into the present bringing vintage cars yeah. vintage dresses um the old school Style trend fashion. everything everybody loves his song and you all know the song we're talking about this the song is uh, and who names the song Dodo, by the way? Uh, he like, would name the song. And I didn't song. even see one Dodo. I think David is the only one that would name his song Dodo and it will blow. Like, yeah. it blow past plantain. I know, right? <laughs> nice. <laughs> okay, guys, this is David with Dodo. David with Dodo. That sounds good. Nice, David Dodo. 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 Because he's an OBO. <laughs> Check it out. Enjoy this one.
I think you're. I know you're trying to wonder what we're doing right now because I know everybody's been enjoying the show, but we're about to go. And you're but just you coming in. <laughs> Sorry, you're so late, but just this is the best we can do. We can just <laughs> show you <laughs> how we've been enjoying the, the oh, show. Oh, stop it right now! <laughs> <laughs> it's been an amazing, amazing time on the show, and exactly. if you're just joining in, I'm sorry to tell you, you missed so so much. It really, it's like it's not like we just enjoy saying you missed, what? but the honest thing is, like you missed. You missed. So <laughs> if you want to really connect or plug in with us, you can just go on social media. Of course, yes, you can always catch up with us in order not to miss us. Still, we're back on social media. On Facebook is www.facebook.com forward slash Muse on TV. On Instagram and Twitter is at Muse on TV. Now, on this note, guys, um, we can't say much but to say keep on doing what you love doing because yeah. someday it's going to show off because it looks like this year a lot of people that have been working so hard down to yeah. T.Y. that is looking like she's going to be signed to Rock Nation. Yeah, I think it's not looking like that. It is happening it's already. It's going to be happening already. Down to Whiskey that's going on war tour down with Chris to Brown. Down to Fouls, the B.A.T. thingy. Down to Fouls, the B.A.T. thingy. I it think looks, it's going to be our turn soon. Like, dude, like it's gonna, just keep because, because our turn is coming soon, it means your turn is going to come soon. So yeah. why don't you just keep on doing what you love doing? Because somebody is going to pay off. Yeah. <laughs> on this note, we have to say B.Y.E. We're going to see you real soon. Bye. Bye.